back down for a late evening into early morning trip on the lake. Hopeful of a fish or two. There's a few tents rolling. Just using simple running leisure rig, low resistance, quick change run ring, and a one and one ounce Palatrax stones lead system, lead or stone lead Palatrax stones, and a size 10 Palatrax the hook. As I say, simple running rig, just baiting up with a few small boys, some Esther Berry boilies, and a light amount of corn, and some nice grilled hemp mixed with molasses ground bait. Got my paws crossed for a tench or two, but play it by ear. Just hopeful of the one would be nice, but anything more, always welcome. Lovely evening, lovely conditions. If anything's biting, the mosquitoes certainly are. Get the net one here. Wonderful bite, wonderful bite as well. I was just sorting my hands out after putting those few balls of ground bait in. Rod's torn off. Brothers literally turn around to me and go, You gotta run! As I just turn around to wipe my hands. And um, yeah, lovely, lovely result. Beautiful condition. Look at that. That's on a Richworth 15mm Esterberry boiler. And just on the simple low resistance power track stone lead and low resistance running rig on a size 10 power tracks the hook and seven pound Preston Innovations power line hook link or Preston Innovations exceed should I say really nice beautiful condition as well look at that beautiful teddy bear eyes as I say it's, it's you can see it's in mint condition how wonderful absolutely superb draw myself back there we go superb absolutely wonderful and look at that you could paint your living room with it, couldn't you? What a paintbrush paddle. Yes. Wonderful. Let's get this absolute olive beauty slip back. Right, before I recast, just quickly go through my setup. Main lines, £10. And that's Gray's Grey Long. Nice and supple. I've got this in £10 and £12. This is £10. Quick change, low resistance run ring. Uh, by a company known as Nine Bream. Uh, if you message me on YouTube, I can put you in contact because the chap only sells via eBay these days. He doesn't have a website anymore. Um, and of course, one ounce power tracks, the stones, lead replacement system, match the gravel bed perfectly. Down from there, buffer bead, anti tangle tube just to kick the rig away. And this is Preston Inno Innovations XE in seven pound. Down from there, power tracks, the hook, size 10 and a little liner liner kicker to help flip the hook over. I'm not using any counterbalance, any putty to help aid in the hooking. So I do feel at times it can make the fish a bit finicky. And also this particular lake with the weed, as I'm not using solid bags or anything like that, there's a good chance they could get jammed up in the weed and it wrecks the presentation. On from there, little PVA mesh bag, crushed their Esterberry boilies and the 15mm Esterberry boilie on the head. It's as simple as it gets. Very low resistance. Anyway, let's get this back out and see what develops.
Nice early morning tinker run, very nice. Unfortunately, I say unfortunately from an angler's perspective at least, I uh, did spot my brother. And you spotted the otter, you see? Otter, yeah. It isn't so good, it doesn't take long on the shallow waters to decimate it, so I just hope that isn't going to be the case in the long term with this lovely wild gravel pit. But yeah, very nice, looks a nice looking tinker. condition heck of a scrap really really put this wide paddle and should I say proud dorsal to good use lovely looking fish really good scrap I'm using just a Shimano travel concept telescopic spinning rod casting weight 10 to 30 grams so you can imagine it's a nice through action but yeah a bit of sterling job very nice too gorgeous condition Absolutely picture perfect, like they all seem to be in this particular water. Very nice. Let's just draw myself back. There we go. How resplendent is that? Absolutely gorgeous. And as I say, we did spot an otter. So hopefully, these lovely ladies and males and females, glorious olive greens, can stay as safe as can be expected in a shallow lake. It is what it is though, with no areas free from otters these days. Anyway, let's get this gorgeous looking tinker. Slip back to rest up and nestle in the weed beds. Superb. I tell you what, that's a fish to be very happy with. I can tell you that now. What an absolute beauty. Look at that, olive green perfection. Yep. Can't win them all. What a pity. What a pity. Mm -hmm. And there you go. The proof, as they say, is in the slime. Lucky. I did have to play that fish up a little bit heavy handed just to keep him from going over to the right hand side and then doubling back into the margins where the trees are. That's the way it goes. Never mind. Says me, I wouldn't have minded a third. Well, it's come to that time where I've got to head off and tell you what, the tench, they are feeding. It's getting a few more knocks there after that hook ball, recast and getting a few more knocks and I'm pretty sure if I stayed longer I didn't have time constraints, not able to fish through the morning time, which is a little bit gutting, but you know, that's life. We all have our, you know, things that come calling that we have to deal with and life itself has to be dealt with as such but it's been thoroughly enjoyable those two nice tench bit of a you know gutting feeling losing an anticlimactic feeling losing that one to a hook pull um that's the way it goes you know sometimes you win some sometimes you lose some uh, it's been thoroughly thoroughly enjoyable and yeah i'm certainly enjoying fishing for the old tinkers and certainly enjoying these surroundings anyway I have got to be shooting off, so 
you know if you have enjoyed the video do take time to consider sharing it on social media place it on your facebook page on your group pages on your forums online your websites etc that'd be very very appreciated and very helpful for me as well so if you would that would be most good of you and i'd be very 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 as i say appreciative and grateful and of course if you have enjoyed the video do take time to consider giving it a thumbs up that would be very very kind of you if you're not subscribed do consider clicking that subscribe button and the bell icon and you'll be kept up to date with all my latest uploads you'll get email notifications of when i do upload plus there's a good back catalogue of old videos to peruse and enjoy with many entertaining moments be that me catching fish or me doing something daft like falling in the in the river or slipping over <laughs> or doing something daft elsewhere anyway do hope you've enjoyed the video and I hope you're enjoying your own fishing and if you are always take time to remember that it's mainly and most importantly about just enjoying and being out there wetting the line a fish is a bonus and it's not always all about size either you know if you can catch picture perfect looking fish and they're really gorgeous and you know immaculate condition that really does count for a whole lot anyway Catch you on the flip side, guys, on another video. Take care.